right, so last time y'all saw, I took on Sacred the Minotaur. Now I'm going to go see if I can find his brother. So I need to go straight. Another fight. Turn my head to the side of my arm went kind of numb there. Must have pinched a nerve. We need to knock this thing down a peg. I, I hate Armaldos. I hate them. I'm gonna hit him with everything I've got. I need to look and see if, see if Diablo has uh, Doom down pat. I saw it said that someone had learned Doom. So I want to make sure that I can use that now. Because Doom is like a... It's, it's a very dirty, very just... Perfect attack for this. That should have killed it right there, but it didn't. This last one should get it. Okay, now it's deciding to pick on Squall, which is good, because I, I can take the attacks on Squall. I need to start trying to get some better weapons here, because using like the base weapons, although I like the way the base uh, gunblade looks, I need to start getting like the better ones. This is this, I hate the one thing I hate about this this labyrinth is it's such a just hard place to get out of, and there's so many beasts in here. But I have been picking up some awesome stuff. Let me see here. I'm gonna see if I can junction some skills here. Junction squall. Ability. There we go. We do have Doom now. Spirit plus 20. Draw. Use Doom on one enemy. Junction. Irvin. Junction. Ability. Okay, he can't do it, so it must have been Shiva that must have learned it. Go ahead and set him up with Spirit plus 20, Junction, Selfie, Junction, Ability, she doesn't really have anything yet, Junction, Magic, This is starting to fit in. Right. And then there should be like a straight way. Alright, yeah, that door's open now. So that's awesome. And there should be a draw point here. We're going to let Squall draw that. Alright. I know exactly what I want to do with them floats. Junction, Squall... Junction magic. Oh, I can't put mag I can't put float to it. But 
Oh, that's okay. We got them now, so we can actually use them on on the stat on the team. So let's go. Kind of draw point. Nothing there. Let's go here. That opens up the floodgate. Leave the chamber now, and we'll go straight. Right. Then left. Then right. Then left. <laughs> it seems repetitive, I know. Then right. then straight. And that's the other gate right there. Over here should be a draw point. We'll have Selfie draw some cures. There's a save point out here. Definitely want to save my work. Get that first. Item. Tent. Then save. Yeah, I dropped my. I see. I dropped my seed rank there for leaving. The game will let you know real quick when you drop your seed rank. Then let's go pull this cog out. All right. Leave the chamber. And now we go straight. Straight. After the battle, of course. So one thing I think that helps me out is getting these battles in. Alright, these guys. I don't mind fighting these guys because I can make them go quickly. Hit him with a little bit of diamond dust, and then hit him with some like thunder, which is Ketsukado's. Uh, I can't remember Ketsukado's like summon. This should get rid of them here. Thunderstorm, that was it. Ketsukadal is still one of my favorite summons of all time. Like, I remember playing this and, like, being amazed at how well it looked. Compared to, like, other summons. Like, I loved... I like Shiva. And... I like the way Diablo looks, but Ketsukata always just kind of, like, was one of my faves. Got two Blobber's cards, which I can break those down once I learn the uh, card match. So let's see. I think I was going straight this time as well. Now, right. Left. And left. If I did this right. Yep, there it is. The inner tomb. Yep, 
you, you back again. Took it easy on you last time, but not this time. This is my my big bro with is with me. Now is your chance to run away, man, bro. Yeah, bro. Yo, bro. These guys crashed the tomb. They attacked me. Oh, really? They attacked you? Not bad for a human. Tee hee. The older brother is so cute. Yo, bro. They're making fun of us. Foolish little humans. I'll show you not to judge a book by its cover. I, I love the fact that Minotaur is such a... He's such a tiny little fella compared to, like, Sacred. Alright. I'll use Protect. Cast it on Selfie. Guardian Force. Let's go ahead and hit him with Ketsukadol. Guardian Force. Let's come with Shiva. So this is pretty much a dirty tactic to use with just summoning nothing Guardian Forces. But it's the easiest way to beat them without letting them heal up too quickly. And you see Shiva's doing some damage there. This will kind of nullify some of their damage, too. I, I love being able to beat these guys, because they're, they're very helpful in battles. Like, their attacks do a lot of damage real quickly. See if I can cast something to silence them. Because they're healing up way too quickly and it's making my battle, it's taking my battle a little longer. This is what takes so long is they have like enough space to do their moves. Let's see if I can silence some of that uh, healing that they're doing. I remember this used to be one of my one of my favorite tactics to use was hitting with silence or hitting uh, mobs with silence, especially those that were strong magic users because it would make the fight so much easier. It didn't work, so... I need to heal her up. Life. Oh wow, that's a resurrection spell. with Shiva because Siren didn't do much damage and I want to get this good. I want to get this done quickly. This is going to be a long boss battle, guys. Because they're just... They have a lot of health to them. And their health is comparable to, you know, whatever your health is. Bro, I lost. So we got one. Start putting my guardian forces up for up forward. 
because they can take a lot more damage and I can I can always sacrifice one if I need to to get this battle done. And taking Minotaur out of the fight now makes it a lot easier for us to get what we gotta get done. Or getting taking a uh, sacred out now gives us a chance to really focus more of our damage on Minotaur. Because he'll, he'll heal up quite often. But now that I've got everybody protected, his attacks won't be as devastating on us. I love the I, I love the fact that I can still keep like fighting even though Selfie's in like bad shape right now. I've got to heal her up. Oh, he took her down. No, I got, I got to bring her back. Apparently, her protection wore off. His heal ability is what's messing me up so bad. But if I can do more damage than what he can heal back, you know, it, it won't take long to beat him. Like I'm doing twice as much damage as he's doing to heal. Alright, I'm gonna have Squall try to revolve, uh, or revive, not revolve, self, selfie real quick. Cause this, this dude right here is a little tough. He should be going down though here soon. Healed up. That mower attack. Attack. Let's use Guardian Force, Shiva. Item, Phoenix Town, Selfie. That should give her a chance to heal up and come back. Have her heal everybody quickly, though. I should have put Renault on the team because she's more of a heal, more of a heal magic white mage kind of character anyway. That was the thing. A lot of the traditional classes were taken out during seven. Ah, come on. Shiva. Adam. Ocean. Gotta try to keep my team alive there for a little bit. Because he's literally getting too many hits on him. take more health than he can dish out damage you know that might work out but he still heals himself at 341 and I have no way to silence it because I've tried magic pure urban item phoenix down selfie got to revive selfie and I've got to I've got to heal her up. Yeah, it keeps Irvin alive for a little longer. 
long as he doesn't target her again. GF, Siren, GF, Quetzalcoatl, Item, Potion, Selfie. He is really doing a number on me, guys. Like, this is... This has been kind of tough. And that attack right there just is brutal. Trying to keep her alive long enough has been hard because she really doesn't have much of a help. I'm going to see if I can silence his heal ability and his skills. beat him if I can. I, he's so tough. Especially with that ability to heal like 300 damage. Everybody's protect is wearing off. I gotta start drawing protects. this battle's going to win way too quickly in his favor and I can't have that happen. I've, I've gotten so far on this. Still didn't silence him. Just gained back all but 20 points. God. Now I can just cast it. Magic. Protect. Swall. Oh, he is giving me such a hard time, and I didn't have any floats, which makes it even harder. Him real quick. So now his attacks can't really do anything. Thank God I had a summon on him. I need to bring Selfie back, but I have no way to really keep her alive. I'm just going to have to spam Diva for the rest of the fight here. Because she's really the quickest one. about to kill me. That's fourteen hundred right there. why I did that. Normal shot. Ah, forgot how to use a skill. 
Urban's down. Let's, let's see. GF. I have no way to revive him either. Great. Oh, I messed up. I should have kept Selfie alive, and I didn't think about reviving her. I was just trying to end the battle quickly. So now I've got to try to keep Shiva going for as long as I can to do the damage I need to to beat him. Seven eighteen. That did less. The brothers defeated. There we go. Mighty ones, may we join you? Ah, uh, guys, what a fight! He took out all. He took out three of my. <clears throat> took out three, two of my teammates. Really messed us up bad. But now we have the brothers to summon. You are quite the powerful ones to have defeated the two brothers. Thanks to you, I am now free from this cramped stone coffin. However, there is something I have been thinking of for, uh, for a long time. Is it really necessary to entomb those traveling to the other world after such a long, tiring journey through life? Got the Minotaur card. Alright. Item. I have two Phoenix Downs left. Irvin, Selfie. Magic. Squall. Use. Cure. There. Alright, they're all healed up. Let's get out of this place. Exit the area and take every right to exit the dungeon. So right, right, right. That's not right. I don't think this guy knew what he was writing. I'm gonna try to find my way out of this place. I was looking at a walkthrough and this guy's like, take every right and it's not working. This is a straight way. There we go. Alright guys, so anyway, that's it for today's episode. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. You can check us out on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Leave a comment below. Let me know what you thought of today's video or what you'd like to see me play next. You can click on that bell icon. That's going to keep you up to date with what we're doing, when we're doing it, and all that jazz. Click on the links in the description, or click the description, to, or check the description to see some links from my awesome friends, awesome works. So anyway, thank you all so much for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.